So this week I thought I would do a reading vlog because I don't work too much. So I would, you know, I have the time, which I normally don't. So today is Monday, December 7th, I believe. And in terms of reading, it's not really been going well. I've ordered a bunch of books on Black Friday that I'm so excited to get and read, but they haven't arrived yet. Probably won't for a while because, you know, it takes time with shipping and extra time because of COVID. But last night I started Paperweight by Meg Haston, Haston, which I have read before because I just was in such a mental health book mood and I picked this up because I wanted to read something. But I'm not sure I'm going to continue with it because I have read it and I don't know, I just wanted to pick up something. I'm in the mood for contemporary, like cheesy contemporary or mental health books. But we'll see. But I've started this. I have read two chapters and I do like this. And the reason why I started again is because I would want to annotate and tab it. So I might do that because I do really want to tab it. I didn't do that the first time because it's been a while. So I might continue reading this today. So it's about 11 in the morning, I guess, right now. And I kind of just woke up. <clears throat> woke up because I worked all weekend, so I'm pretty tired. But at 1 o'clock today, we're going to um, a veterinarian for one of my cats. Nothing serious, nothing's happening or, or anything. But we're going and it's a bit of a drive, a little. So we're going to have to get ready in a bit. And yeah, I'm just going to eat breakfast and watch YouTube. Before that, I think I'm actually gonna get ready to put some makeup on because I do feel more alive when I have that recently. I've been feeling that way. So I think I'm gonna do that. And I also received a package today with clothes. I never buy clothes, but it might be fun to show that, I don't know. It's from a website I've never ordered anything from. So maybe nothing will fit, but we'll see. It's a big package, so many clothes. I'm excited. I might show you guys that later. So yeah, but now I'm gonna eat breakfast. It's evening now and we're back from the vet. Everything went fine, perfectly fine. Now he's asleep in front of our fireplace. So after this, I'm gonna go and hang out with him because I don't want him to be alone. He's very, very sleepy, tired, and he doesn't like to go in the car. So he was very nervous about that. But I sat in the back seat with him all the time and I had a heavy toy and everything. So it went well and you know, has to be done. So while he was at the vet, and me and my mom went to the dollar store and I got a couple of things, mostly Christmas gifts. I think I got like two things for myself, but most of this are Christmas gifts. It's like fun little Christmas gifts, cheap ones, because dollar store. But I thought I would show you. So first off, I got some candy for my cats <laughs> for Christmas and then I got for my one cat that he's half ragdoll and half Norwegian forest cat so his fur is very very long and we need to brush it and sometimes we need scissors so I bought this cat scissor hopefully it's good and then I got an EOS balm which for myself which smells sherry and vanilla I believe it smells really really good then I got this cute mug like do you see how cute that is Cookies for Santa, you can have the cookies there and milk there or whatever, hot chocolate, whatever. More candy for my cats. Then I got this after eight for my grandparents because for Christmas, I'm gonna have like, I have bought this 
cute bag and then I'm gonna fill it with stuff for them. So, so far I have uh, a nice soap, I have chocolate, I have another thing I'm gonna show you and then I'm gonna buy like little things to put in there and then give them the beautiful bag. So I got after eight because they do like dark chocolate and this is a classic so. The other thing I got from my grandparents are this lantern. I think it's very very beautiful and it it has um, it's a battery light so it's safe and beautiful and I got it in white because I do think that will fit their house good because they do have a lot of white and this would fit their interior so yeah and I got some chocolates for my mom and these are like I don't know it's so it's white chocolate and milk chocolate like snails and she really really likes these so I got them and this is not like her big gift I've gotten as you can see I have most of my gifts done this is just like small little gifts that are cute and fun. Then I got some cars for my dad. These are Swedish cars and he likes them, so I got them for him. Last but not least, I got hair ties. Is that what it's called? Because mine, I do not know where they go. My youngest cat likes to play with them, so they're all gone, so I got some new ones. I'm very sorry about the unfocusing, but it's really, really dark. The clock is not that much, but you know, we don't get any light in Sweden during winter, so it's very, very dark. Even though I've got all my lights on, it's very, very dark and not a great lighting. So hopefully you can see me. <laughs> and earlier I did read some in paperweight, so I'm on page 45, which is not a lot, but you know. And I did forget to mention what this is about. I just, I don't know what, just slipped my mind. So paperweight is about this girl who goes to a treatment home for her anorexia and it's about her days there, her experience, you get to follow her thoughts and yeah, you get to follow this girl's thoughts, uh, her recovery process, what's behind it, you know, it's it's very interesting. Like I said, I am in the mood for mental health books so that's why I picked it up. But yeah, I'm on page 45, um, want to read a bit more today but we'll see. Um, yeah, but that's what it's about. So I changed the setting because it was too dark down there. So I thought I would show you the clothes I got. Oh, the first one is this really, really comfy. I, I wish you could feel this. It's super comfy and super short. It was a little bit shorter than I would want, but it works with like really, really high-waisted pants, which I have plenty of. I love high-waisted pants. So super, super fluffy and so freaking comfortable. Gray so nice and you have a zipper here just simple but super cute i love it okay. next thing i got is a super cool kind of right my kind of the avril lavigne vibe punk rock vibe punk pop vibe which if you not a lot of people know this not even my closest friends or family like i love punk i listen to punk punk rock punk pop avril lavigne is like my number one uh, idol i love her i love punk like and this just kind of got that vibe so when i saw it online i was just like i need this it has like these chess boards thing it's pretty long very very comfortable simple i liked it i thought it was very retro slash i don't know skater boy avril lavigne i don't know the next piece is the same material as the first one super super comfy and fluffy but just a different length it's longer and it's white and a light gray so but it has a hood and yeah it's very very similar to the first one as i said same material same material super comfy love it i'm gonna live in these because it's cold here it's cold here now the next two things i got is two tops and i only did try on one because the other one is exactly the same just a different color so we have the this it's like a military, military green one, which I did try on, as you can see. And it was a little bit shorter than I wanted to, which you probably can see. It was very, very short. Even with like high-waisted pants, it's very, very short. But it's cute, but it's almost too short for me, I think. And I got it in black as well, because uh, all I wear is black, so always works. Maybe you can have something over it. You can have, you know, it will work. I'm not going to return anything, because... It was very, very cute, so yeah. Yeah, last and final piece that I got is the one I'm wearing, which is, what's it called? Butterfly, the yellow butterfly. 
super simple black. It's probably my favorite because I do love simple black ones. I love sleeve, not too big, not too small. It's the perfect length. I do not like when sweaters or shirts are too long or too um, short. I think this is perfect because I do usually wear high-waisted pants, so perfect. That was it. So now I think I'm just gonna go and sit by our fireplace uh, where my cat is because I don't want him to be alone and it's cold so it will be cozy and I'm gonna bring this because you know Mike gets him rooting in and I am tabbing this so that's fun. Yeah, hopefully I'll do some progress yesterday because it was kind of a boring day I needed to study so I did that and it went really well I was very productive I finished a lot of stuff that's always a nice feeling then I had a meeting at work which is kind of boring but needed to be done and yeah it was kind of a boring day but today is Wednesday it's gonna be a boring day today too because I work tonight all night like 2 p.m. to 10 p.m. so I'm not gonna vlog at all basically, but I wanted to tell you that I'm gonna put down paperweight because I, I got bored <laughs> and I started Anna and the French Kiss. It's a reread, but it's been a while. I think it's been a year exactly. I read this last Christmas for the first time and I love this series, not only this book, but the entire series. And, and the reason for my reread of this cute book is because I recently ordered the beautiful collector's edition, which should come, not yet, it's gonna take a while, but it's so beautiful and I just kind of wanted to refresh and reread this so I can be reminded of how cute it is. So yeah, I'm actually, I read a lot last night. Yeah, I'm on page 221, so I get through this very, very easy and fast. It's a very fast read for me. Plus it is a reread, so. But yeah, I love it and can't wait for my beautiful collector's edition to come. I'm gonna show you when, but probably it's gonna take a while, like a week, two weeks, because the book depository takes a while. So but yeah, I'm excited and this is so cute. I love it. Friday, December 11, and I have not logged in a bit just because yesterday I worked and I just slept, so, you know, <laughs> and, but today's Friday, I'm off, it's already late, but I haven't worked today, I've been chilling, I've been cleaning, I have a bit more cleaning to do, I'm gonna vacuum, but I clean my bookshelves and reorganize them a little bit, but so somehow I'm just never satisfied with how they look like I wrote an Instagram post about it and everything I'm just never satisfied with how it looks I don't know it's probably just in my head and you know obviously living at home you have this little space it's probably gonna be better when you move and you have more space to play around with and yeah I don't, I'm just never satisfied with them how they look how the books I don't know probably because you compare yourself to like other you compare your bookshelf to other bookshelves you know but yeah, reading wise, I'm reading this as you know, and I do not know when I updated you guys last, but I'm on page 
2.56. I have not read anything today. And I don't know if I will because I'm just gonna... I'm about to start studying right now. Um, might be doing some reading later or this weekend because I have the entire weekend off. We'll see, but it's definitely a quick read, as I said, so it's gonna be quick to finish. But yeah, I'm gonna start studying because I have two assignments to turn in every week. I have a little bit left on one of them, but not so much. But we'll see how... I decide and this weekend I'm planning on wrapping some gifts because I have some wrapping to do and also I do all the wrapping in this house except for the ones for the package that is to me like but mom always comes to my health because she knows I love wrapping so I usually do all the family wrapping and my me and my mom are gonna bake some Christmas stuff Christmas cookies Christmas candy I don't really know we'll see but it's gonna be fun also I'm so excited to watch Supernatural this weekend. So if you know me and you've watched my vlogs earlier, I love TV shows. I'm a huge TV show nerd. And I recently started watching Supernatural because it has not been on any Swedish streaming site before. Like, probably before, but like in a while. <laughs> um, so I haven't been able to watch it. And now it's on one of our Swedish uh, streaming sites. So I'm so excited. I'm on season two loving it and I'm flying through it so I'm so excited to watch more this weekend. I love it. It's honestly kind of creeped me out. Some episodes creep me out. I'm not gonna sit here and tell you guys in case you haven't seen but yeah some episodes in the beginning I was like I could not watch at night when it was dark <laughs> but yeah I'm loving it uh, and there's like 15 seasons maybe more I don't know but it's so many seasons so I'm very excited to catch up on that I guess. Yeah, let me know if you guys have any series that you watch right now. As I said, I'm a huge TV show nerd, so if you have any recommendations or, you know, let me know because I love to find new ones that are good. So, I can handle a lot of genres, I think. I do like fantasy, like Supernatural, Grimm. Have you seen Grimm? It's so good. It's so good. I'm gonna re-watch re re that some uh, time. I love Grimm. 100, I'm currently watching two, but I've kind of gotten bored. I'm like on season three, maybe. And it's just a lot. Like, I loved the first season. And now I don't really know. I'm watching Skins. <laughs> Skins UK. And this show has been with me for a while. Like, I discovered that when I was very, very young. And it's, if you haven't seen it, you know what I'm talking about. It's rough. It's... It's a lot, but it's so funny, like, to me, it's really iconic, and it's an iconic show, and I want to finish it. Now I'm on the, like, the second generation, is that what you call it? I do like the original original cast, but now you have the, like, second set of 16-year-olds, and it's fine so far, but some people are just crazy, I don't know. But I'm excited to finish that one. Mm, do not know how many seasons there is, but yeah. But now I'm gonna study some because school and I want to you know be able to graduate so yeah that's fun haha <laughs> bye hey guys it's Saturday and I'm sorry if I have to be quiet because everyone's home and stuff but I did end up finishing and did the French kids last night and it was as cute as always and I just wanted to hop on here and say it I loved it again <laughs> and I can't wait for my beautiful collector's edition to come but yeah super cute and I do recommend it. It's fast and easy and I got through it very very fast. I also got some book mail yesterday so I thought I would open them because I didn't do that yesterday. Yeah, from Book Depository. So this is a sequel to Until Friday Night which is a book I recently read and loved so I ordered the sequel and I'm super super excited. Number two. Yes, I did that. I think I'm gonna do a video about reading this because I kind of did it as a fun thing. <laughs> I'm gonna have, I'm gonna enjoy this. I, I like cheesy things like this, but I think I'm gonna do a video about it. I'm excited. So this is the book that I will be starting. Probably gonna start tonight because I'm in the mood to read. So yeah, this is gonna be my next read and I'm very excited. I love the first book and I think it has like four or five books. So I'm very, very pleased about that. 
So it's Sunday and I thought I would end the vlog soon, but I'm just gonna update you guys on how this is going. So I had a bit last night. I'm on page 123. So I read a lot last night and I'm planning on continuing tonight. And yeah, and you will see that in next week's reading vlog, I hope. I work a lot next week, but hopefully I will still have time to do one. I hope so. But yeah, I hope you liked this week's reading vlog and I will see you in my next one. Bye. I have an exciting thing that happens next week, so it will be fun to vlog, but we'll see. I'm super nervous about that. It's happening on Thursday, so... But yeah, we'll see. Bye. Also, we did some baking this week, so insert that footage right here.